Good evening, folks, and welcome to the realm of Metroid Junkie, where you will experience awkward let's playing from the self-proclaimed worst let's player in the world. Let's get started, shall we? Now, in the last one, I've been tinkering around with this robot, and I realized something. I can just make a new one from scratch. That would probably be a lot better for experimentations. So, let's go ahead and do that, shall we? Okay, let's start building from the ground up. First off, I want to build something that can actually fly, so I'm going to use the bare minimum amount of parts possible. And let's see if we can get this baby flying or something. Maybe. Maybe. I mean, I'm, I'm using pretty much no parts, except for this very tiny base right here. And I'm going to give it pretty much everything that I can possibly give it. Which means if this doesn't fly, then it was impossible to begin with, and I should quit wasting my time. Right? I would assume so. This is about as... This is about as bare minimum as I can possibly make it, with as many flying parts as I could possibly give them. So I would assume that if this can't fly, nothing can fly. Let's face it. This would probably destroy itself. Ooh, holy crap. Okay, it can fly, just not very well. And I don't have any weapons either. So that does present a problem. Okay, so I have proven conclusively that if we go at the bare minimum, I can sort of fly. Yay for me! I've proven that you can fly, good for me. I've done what the Wright brothers already did decades ago, but whatever. It's, a, it's an achievement for me, for me personally, that it can fly. That it is possible to make a robot fly. It just has to be extremely lightweight, so as to propel itself. But let's see how hefty I can make it while making it capable of lift. Actually. Oh, no. Uh, what the hell? What the hell is that? No, no. Oh, press enter to type. Help. Okay, that doesn't help me. Inventory. Is there a way to actually push this upward? Because that would be great if I could just push it upwards a bit. I guess there isn't. That sucks. I guess I just have to do this. I want to try something. I want to make it sort of a jet plane type design here. Yeah, that way it can have lasers all across here. While still hopefully propelling itself enough that it won't be a problem. Hopefully. Let's just get rid of that for now. Yeah, I'm just going to make it a little... Well, it's sort of like a jet engine. I'm thinking of Raptor Call of Shadows because I played the hell out of that game when I was a kid. I actually still do from time to time. It's for MS-DOS. It was this top-down shooter that, in my opinion, was way ahead of its time. Because instead of just having a simple scoreboard, the score was actually how much money you earned, and you could actually upgrade your ship, get new weapons, get more health, get all that good crap. So, it was one of my fa it was one of my childhood favorites. Not gonna lie. Okay. I'm assuming that this is still capable of flight. I mean, I didn't add that much to it. And if I can add, uh, say, top lasers? No, then it, then it just aims down, and that's not good. Well, unless I wanted to rain hellfire from above. Nah. Or unless I wanted to rain hellfire down with these. That might be. No, I should probably shoot forward. It would probably be a good idea, actually. I'm gonna move that backwards so that I can do just that. I'm actually gonna put them on the top now. Yeah, that might be better. What do you think? You can't, I can't hear you, you silly. I haven't even uploaded yet. What were you thinking? Whether you were talking or not, I don't know, but I'm gonna assume you tried, so in that case, you're silly. Okay. Let's get that out of the way so that I can actually put stuff on it without it. <laughs> I love when these games have weird collision detection, where it's not even in the way, but yet because the colliding box is in the way, it prevents you from putting it there anyway. Uh, it's whatever. Okay. I can't do- oh, crap. I, I was supposed to turn those around, my bad. Wait. Oh, crap. 
No, I didn't mean to do that. I was pressing R. I thought that was supposed to rotate it. Crap. Okay, how do I rotate it? No, no, I didn't mean to do that. Crap. How do I rotate it? Okay. Yeah, let's see now. Wait. What's the information? Nope, it doesn't tell me how to rotate it. Oh, alright. Mouse wheel. That would make sense. That would make a lot of sense. Too bad I don't have any sense. <laughs> okay, that'll work. Maybe. Possibly. I don't know. Okay, let's see if I can actually fly. Let's see if we can take this puppy airborne. What do you say? If we can, then that'll be awesome. It's very lightweight, which means it probably won't have very much health at all. But if it can fly, it'll be worth it. There we go. Nice. It's very light. Yeah, in fact, it can fly pretty easily. In fact, it's not even having the weight distribution problem that it was having before. This is cool. Too bad I can only, too bad I can only aim at level though. That kind of sucks. Or can I? I know. It just goes forward wherever it's turned. Unfortunately, we, we may have hit a snag here because it's not so much aiming in the direction I want it. That, that's uh, going to be a problem. How do I go down? Okay, that might be a slight problem too. I don't even know how to get down. You know what? Actually, I think I'm going to go for that thing that I had an idea for earlier, which was rain hellfire down below. Won't that be amazing? I got an idea. Just you watch. Let's see them survive this. They can't. That's the answer. They cannot. Ha, <laughs> that is cool. Check that out. Now it's death from above, dropping the bombs. Man, in, in actual combat, this might not be very efficient, but oh well. It'll be kick-ass. Oh, wow. It is not balanced at all. It is not balanced in any way whatsoever. Oh, well. It works enough, I guess. It works well enough for what I need it for. And I can actually aim with them. I just have to be directly above when I'm hitting. Nice. They all actually aim in the direction I want pretty perfectly. The only real problem is that there are so many of them that it burns out my ammo, as you can see, really quickly. But that won't really matter in combat, because by the time I run out of ammo, they should be good and dead. Let's try it. Let's try an actual combat. I'm excited about this. This is going to be kick-ass. Right, aren't you guys excited? Ah, who cares if you're excited? I'm excited, and that's all that counts. Am I right? Okay. Actually, maybe I can add some more stuff on here just to give it some more health or something. Actually, I gotta make sure it can fly first. If it can't fly, I'll probably remove something. Okay. <laughs> wow, that's just that's just great, isn't it? Okay, it's a little it's a little slower to take off now, but it'll work. It's kind of silly how it seems to. Yeah, it seems to be very top heavy, probably because of that. No, wait, bo bottom heavy, it's back heavy, because of that thing back there. I may have to fix that. Hang on. I may have a solution here. Not sure if it'll work. But hey, everything's worth trying once, right? I've got an idea. Okay. On. Okay. I just remove these. Just add one of you in the middle, like on the other side. And then. No, wait, actually. Yeah, I'll just do it like this. It'll be more balanced out in terms of weight distribution. 
That's always a good thing, weight distribution. You gotta be concerned about that. Crap. Because it's on the ground, I can't really do much of that. Well, that sucks. Huh. Well, that'll work. Maybe. But then it'll be a little left heavy. Oh well. Who cares? Actually, I got a better idea. If this will work. No, no, no. Nope, it won't work. Crap. Well, that sucks. Actually, maybe this will work. Okay, that works. And I don't have to worry about the plasma weapons getting in the way either, because they're below it. They'll fire below it. No problem at all. In theory. Oh, crap. Did it make it worse? No, it wasn't any worse than before. Okay. I should be good. I mean, probably. It doesn't appear to be a problem. It should be just fine. Yeah, I'll be fine. Yeah, I'll be fine. Let's try this puppy in combat. Let's go straight into the combat field and give this baby a try. Because I've got some shields that'll absorb some damage. Funny thing is, it's, it also reminds me of Raptor Call of the Shadows. Okay, back to main menu. I'm proud of this. I'm gonna call it Raptor Jet. Because why the hell not? Let's try it in combat. AI bots deathmatch. Team deathmatch. Eh, AI bots. I wonder if that other one involves human players. Eh, I don't really care. I'm a bitter loner anyway. Death. This is team deathmatch. Kill Sweet. the enemy team to win. Kick ass. The first team to reach the target total wins. Don't worry, guys. I'll, I got it all settled out. I, uh, I'm perfect. I'll just go straight over the top. I'm guessing the enemy doesn't have any helicopters. Yeah, that's what I thought. Taste death, bitch. They can't even touch me. Well, okay, they can't touch me, but not very well. I have a huge advantage of them over them over here. Up here. Okay, just gotta get a hit off of them. This may have been a bad idea. Because my aim is off too. And he's he's got lasers, they're faster. Ooh! Thanks for doing pretty bad. Nice! Okay, just gotta just gotta finish him off. Yes! Yes! I am kick-ass. Crap. Although the scoreboard is equal. Okay, there you are. Taste death! Crap, am I even hitting him? I was missing him entirely. Wow. Nicely done, D. I should probably let my weapons regenerate a little bit. Bitch. Wait, am I losing stuff? 
might fall apart. Okay, teams are equal for now. I gotta be the one to break that. I gotta get us the advantage we need. Take this, bitch. You like plasma death coming from above. And that doesn't feel too good, does it? I may be vulnerable in this form, but you are most certainly vulnerable. I have an advantage up here. You can hardly touch me. Your aim isn't so good up here. Not that mine is any better, but still. Oh crap, now they're up, they're up ahead. I gotta be assisting my team here. I can't just keep flying and nicking around all day. Even though I do seem to be great at drawing their attention. Come on. I'm missing every shot. Maybe I would have been better off with lasers. I don't know. That plasma would be better because it does more damage and it's kind of like a bomb. But maybe lasers would have been better. This is more accurate. I don't know. Okay. Oh, crap, they're still out ahead. I gotta help my team. Maybe I should lower myself a little down towards their level. I forgot how. Crap. Crap, how do you lower yourself again? I gotta get lower. Whatever, I'll just cut them from here. Crap. Now they're ahead. Oh wait, they were they were ahead before. Crap. They're still ahead. Okay, gotta kill them fast. Well, I can't do that because the boss is shooting so much. Damn it. Well, they've got their attention on me, that's for sure. Like that, bitch. No idea how to descend. That may be a, that may be a flaw in the system of mine. No way of descending. Well, no way to control the descent, I mean. Did I just kill that guy? I think I did. Hey, you wanna give me some ground support, guys? I mean, I can't kill them all myself. Or at all. Crap, my helicopter blades are destroyed again. I gotta... I gotta get out of enemy territory until it throws back, which it just did. Sweet. Okay, I probably shouldn't accept... I should, probably shouldn't go up so much. It's preventing me from getting shots off on it. I'm just going around here. This seems like a good vantage point. Yeah, I can hit them without a problem. And it should also be easier than normal to avoid their attacks, too. Probably shouldn't be too hard. Theory. But hey, that's just a theory. A robot theory. Yes. Damn it, they're way out ahead. Crap. This isn't good. It's very bad. Crap, they're ahead by three. It's not good. My teammates aren't carrying their weight. They aren't doing it. They aren't helping at all. They're not helping. They're not adding to the cause. How dare they? How dare they suck so badly? I mean, I've been alive. I'm still alive. But apparently they can't do the same. I know I've been hovering above the action. Which makes me harder to hit, but still. There we go. Okay, I got one. We are now within one point of theirs. Good. We could actually win this. I hope we don't lose. I mean, I lost the last time. We lost the last time. It was a collective team loss. Come on, bitch. There we go. I think I killed one. Seriously? Seriously? Team defeated. Well, you can't blame me. I was doing better than... Okay. I was doing the third best of my team. 
And I did better than almost all there. Well, okay, that guy had more kills. But I had no defeats. I had the least defeats. And if you count the assists, I killed eight guys. So, you know, take that what you will. That was not my fault. You cannot say it was my fault. It was my lousy teammates' fault. Okay, I'm gonna try something else. I'm gonna try a tank this time. Whatever. I, I, I was I was defeated. I don't care. Screw you. Okay. I'm gonna try a tank this time. Just a really tough Tonka tank. Yeah, won't that be kick ass? Won't that be kick ass? Okay. Of course, we're gonna need some foundation. And what is a good tank without some treads? I may as well include two. Oh crap! I can't do two. Of they should. Oh, it's because I haven't connected them yet. I haven't properly connected them. No wonder. It's not that I can't have more than one. It's that they have to be connected somehow. Yeah, that makes a lot more sense, doesn't it? Okay, so I I should be able to do this no problem. In theory, theoretically, there we go, and there we go, perfect, perfecto, now I just have to connect that one, bloop, 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 and there we go, uh, a pretty long ass tank, if I do say so myself, it won't have any jumping or flight capabilities. It'll be stuck to the ground, but it will be kick-ass. It will have weapons galore. It will be armed to the teeth. It will be revved for combat. And all that good crap. It will be a force of nature. It will have lasers. It will shoot without mercy. Apparently, this allows you to detect whatever's on your allies' radar, so it'll allow me, it will allow me to view enemies much farther away as long as my allies are near them. Well, that'd be awesome. Alright, be right back again. Oh, it demands more space. Well, sorry, princess. I didn't realize you were so strict. Still, holy crap. It's gonna be a big ass tank when I'm done. But I like it! I like big ass tanks! Hells yeah! Oh, well, there we go! Check this bad boy out! Ain't that awesome! If that isn't kick ass, I don't know what is. Okay! <laughs> that is pretty cool! Now we just give it some flair. You know? Make it look a bit more well rounded. And we actually, I got an even better idea. I'll make it even more rounded. How cool is that? Oh, I can do this, can't I? There we go. Check that out. It looks funny. It looks like an apple that someone bit into. But hey, it's stylish. At least I think so. You guys think it's stylish? Don't care. Doing it anyway. What do I care what you think? I care lots what you think, but I can't hear you anyway because, you know, I'm still recording the video. I haven't uploaded it yet. Let's test it out. You know, I hope they can aim properly. I just realized... Then again, they aim properly on the walkers, so why wouldn't they be able to... Did I put it backwards? Oh, crap. Well, this is embarrassing, isn't it? This is embarrassing for all of us. I put everything on backwards. How could I? How could I? Well, this is unfortunate. I didn't realize it was on backwards. Crap. That's very bad for me. Very awkward. Can I just reverse the, the treads and make it? No, of course not. Crap. I put everything on backwards. Oh, crap. Actually, this may be able to work. If I get rid of everything, maybe I can just flip 
the orientation around. It might work, I don't know. I have no freaking idea. Yeah, it might just be able to work. It'll be a little bit awkward, but hell, why not? Okay. No, this way. No! This way! What are you doing? Come on. Come on. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. We gotta cooperate and stuff. Okay? <laughs> I keep doing it wrong. Okay, there we go. Much better. Get rid of you. Add you. If Okay, that'll work. That'll definitely work. Huh. In a way, that actually looks kind of cooler. I'm glad it happened by quote-unquote accident. <laughs> totally not by accident. <laughs> I wonder if there's enough to, put, to shove these on here. Because adding shielding would be better for me. It would be way better for me. Yeah, there we go. That's actually kind of cool. Although they're not the same size. They're not the same type of shield, so it's not exactly symmetrical. Holy crap, that one's just huge. I better put that in the center. Not enough robot CPU. Well, crap. Well, maybe I can just get rid of that one then. Okay, cool, I can. That one's way bigger, so I'm guessing it generates a lot more shieldage. If you know what I mean. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Top laser hornet. What does that do? Cool. Too bad it just added another weapon. Oh well. It'll come in handy if I'm out of one. If I gotta recharge for one. Maybe... I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. Maybe... It'll allow me to fire when the other one has to recharge or something. Okay, it does. It, it all goes on the same ammo. It's kind of like Wolfenstein 3D. You know, minus the flamethrower. That that came in the expansion in the rocket launcher. I'm talking about the machine gun, the chain gun, the the pistol. They pretty much derived on the same ammo. So it's pretty much just like that, isn't it? Okay. The none of these particularly seem to drain it all that fast. So we're good on that front. Now let's test this bad boy in combat. Because what good is a robot if you can't kick somebody's ass with it? Am I right? The last one was above the was above it all, but this is down and personal. You bet back to main menu. Let's see, Fox Tank. Because that is a reference both to Star Fox 64 and Metal Gear Solid. Two for the price of one. Another AI bot deathmatch, would you please? Also, I level up, so I'll be able to get more CPU. Even if I don't win, I'll probably still level up. This you is know, team deathmatch. Kill the enemy. But I don't to intend win. to lose. The first team to reach the target total wins. Crap! I, it probably wouldn't be a good idea to flip myself over. I wonder which does more damage: the front laser, th these two individually, or these collectively? I would assume that because those are collectively and they seem to be draining the the energy faster, you know, the ammo reserves, that it might be stronger. I don't know. Now, this thing doesn't turn very well. Must have stopped it. Crap. This isn't turning out very well for us, is it? Okay, good. Good. Maybe we do stand a chance. Come on, turn around. On the plus side, I can sh I can turn around and shoot at them while I'm walking while I'm running away. I can sort of circle strike to an extent. Hopefully, friendly fire is not thing. Oh, good. He's down on the ground. Finish him. There, good. That's another kill for us. Holy crap, we're doing much better than last time. Maybe the problem was I should have been more focused in my build. It's too scattered. And now I know better. 
And I have a radar, and I'm not even using it. I should be using it. I'm not even, I don't even have a, a robot with legs. It kind of turns awkwardly, but on the plus side, I can keep moving and like fire from the side or something. It's like firing from the hip. It's like circle striking. No, I can't face him head on. I got a circle strike around him. Oh, is he stuck? Oh, I'm stuck too. Crap. Well, this is embarrassing. Crap. I need to turn around. Why the hell am I not turning? For some reason. on my side. My bad. Hopefully friendly fire isn't taking this game. Like I said before, I'm pretty sure, yeah, I remember saying that before. Hopefully that's not a thing here. And even if I can't kill them, at least I can distract them while my teammates can help them with plasma. Which seems to do more damage when they do it for some reason. Don't know why. Maybe they just have better weapons than I do. I don't have good enough weapons yet. Oh crap, I gotta run away. Fast. I only got 25% health. Oh, shit. Okay. Yep. I died. My bad. Okay, we're still on uh, we're still out ahead, it doesn't matter. And I've got a shield too. That'll make me harder to hit. Okay, right clicking goes in the sniper. Okay, I should probably turn around. Nice! I achieved level 3! I can do even more than before! Elms to the air! Now then, where are you? By the way, not sure if you guys noticed, but starting with the Pokemon do that I should have uploaded to... Uh, is it on that Monday? Not too long ago. Should be by now. Yeah. You should have noticed that the video quality started improving a lot. That's because I figured out that I've been un undershooting the crap out of the bitrate on OGS. So I fixed it, and that's why the FLV files were so small. Because I was underscoring the crap out of bitrate, and that's also why they were getting so pixelated all the time every time I moved around. It wasn't the resolution, it was just the bitrate, and thankfully I can jump that the hell up without having to worry about the frames dropping. It just means that the FLB will be a lot bigger, but it shouldn't be a big problem. You know, so long as... So long as I can take the storage space. That's the only thing it really affects, the storage space. Crap. I gotta kill this guy. He's lost his legs, so he should be easier to kill. Theoretically. Okay, there we go. Okay. Did my weapons get destroyed? Is that why I, I seemingly wasn't able to fire at him? Crap, I gotta turn around. Crap. Probably get away before I destroy myself. Or I flip over and become a 
courtesy of them because I'm an idiot. Whatever, we're still winning. I don't care. I may have made a jackass out of myself, but we're still winning, so who cares? At the end of the day, you still suck. You can still suck my guns. Okay, cool. Okay. Sweet. If there's one thing I love doing, it's kicking things when they're down, especially my enemies. Kicking my enemies when they're down is my specialty. Go away. Go away, you. Go away. Go the hell away. Oh, crap. Help! I've fallen and I can't get up! Ah, help me! I've fallen and I can't get up! Crap, I don't kill myself. They spawn. Okay. I didn't give them a kill, did it? I hope it did. Oh well. I need to watch out for that. I seem to have a bad habit of my things falling over on themselves. And then there becomes no way to get them back up. There's gotta be a way to prevent that. There's gotta be something that I can put on them so that when they're down, when they're down, they can pick themselves back up or something. Okay, come on, bitch. It's just you and me. I wanted to save my friend, but you just killed him. Which means it's payback time, you MO. I'm not even gonna run away. I'm gonna pelt on. I'm gonna be on you like a swarm of angry hornets. Oh, two on one? That is hardly fair, you bitch. You little bitch. That is hardly fair. Okay, don't have your friend now. Let's see it. Let's see how you handle being two on one. That's what I thought. The scores of the winning team have doubled. Yes. So I have two, 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 two. Nice. Kill, six, deaths, four, let's ignore that. Assists, five, yes. That's 11 overall. I did pretty good. Even though apparently my teammates all do better than me. <laughs> they really make me look like a crap head. They really make me look like the one that sucks, don't they? But whatever. I don't really care anyway. Yeah, I don't even care. Okay, as a result of your participation in the leaderboard at the end of your last battle, you've been awarded a bronze playing IR robot CPU games will drastically improve the rarity of the loot received. That thing's about to burst open. I better open it. Yes, more cubes. More rounded cubes. And Apple's gonna sue you. Thruster Panther, a jet engine that provides additional movement. Yes, I already had one in the corner. Nice. Sweet. I can provide more aesthetics. Yes, more robot CPU. That's kick-ass. Hells yeah. Let's see what else I can add onto my tank since I'm, the tank actually won. I'm gonna build up it for, for now. Until it loses, in which case I'm gonna I'm gonna ditch it. First chance I get, because it'll be worthless. Me. And anyway. Ooh, I can actually do this. Crap. Where can I place it? Would that actually work? I mean, I hope it doesn't interfere with the shield. That would suck. I'm guessing it won't. I'm guessing they don't d destroy themselves. That would just be sucky. But anyway. Okay. That should allow me to go faster. Hells yeah. I'm, I'm, I seem to be going a little bit faster. And I should also get rid of... I should get rid of the secondary weapons. Well, if I had more of the front lasers, I would. I want to have more of a specialty. I don't want to have to keep switching weapons. Although, you know, in certain circumstances it would be helpful, but in this case, I don't have that much that I can actually use on it. For some reason. I don't know why. It's whatever. This game is weird. Okay, cool. Not enough robot CPU. Okay, I'll get rid of the- I'll get rid of you. Oh, okay. Is it the same as that? Or what? Which is it the same as? I want to see. I want to see which one it's the same as, because clearly it's one of the two that are already here. Otherwise, it would have asked me to fill in a new slot. Okay, it's, it's one of you. If I had another one, I could put it on another ship. It's like a shoulder plate. It's like a shoulder-mounted gun. Oh, that's... that sucks. Oh, I just realized, because I, sh I, because I placed them there, it keeps shooting into my own... That is a fatal flaw that I made in the design of this. 
My bad. I got a, I got an idea. Just you wait. I got a better idea. I'm gonna remove those rounded corners. And you'll see why in a minute. Get ready, you. For now. Okay. I'll get rid of the rounded corners. As much as they, as cool as they are, this would be even better. Okay. Oh crap, I can't do it. Damn. Did not think that out very th thoroughly, did I? Hmm. Okay, here we go. That might work. Maybe. I don't know. I'm not a rocket scientist. I'm a whatever the hell I am. Okay. Okay, cool. Coolio. There. Actually. There we go. Much better. Nope. Nope. Another part is there. Crap. Oh, hope maybe I can put it on there anyway. It's the same thing, right? Crap, no I can't. Oh, okay, it's the it's that. Well, damn. Crap. This sucks. Okay, <laughs> will this actually work? Because they seem to be able to turn in 360 degrees, so maybe it'll work. Maybe not. Maybe I just need to remove this and we'll be good. I don't know. I don't know why you're asking me. I don't have all the questions. Me? Okay. Yeah, that'll work. Crap. Okay, come on. Did that cause any interference? Doesn't seem to be. Okay, good. There we go. That's the ticket. I knew I could get it. Ah, you know what? Screw it. I don't even need that block. Who cares about it anyway? Who cares? What did that block ever do for me? I can make this even bigger. And add the gun on here. Huh. Not enough robot seep crap. Okay, you know what? Screw it. You're going bye-bye. Hmm. Eh, nah. That'll be fine. Okay. There we go. That'll work. Hopefully. And now they'll have more room to move around on the battlefield. Crap. Wrong one. Or is it? Nope, this is the right one. And I'll just have this one right here, because why not? Because why the hell not? Perfect! Sort of. It's probably... It might be a good idea to put some more blocks down here, that way it's not as prone to... You know... Move around. I mean, this looks like... It's about to fall either on its front or on its back because it's got way too much weight on the sides. Be right back. I'm gonna assemble this. Not enough robot CPU. Well, that just sucks. That just sucks the chrome straight off, don't it? Okay, hopefully this will work. Hopefully. I don't know. I don't have all the answers. Okay, that looks just about good enough. Let's test it to make sure it works properly and all that good crap. that will actually move when I need it to. That's actually cool. Well, okay, it can't go that direction, unfortunately. That is its weakness, but the enemy doesn't have to know that. And unfortunately, when I'm aiming directly on the sides, 
Yeah, that is a blind spot for some of them. But you know, if I'm shooting directly behind or directly, you know, almost directly in front, all the way from here to here, and around here to here, yeah, that'd be fine. That's fine. I can just shoot almost directly from front. Yeah, that'll be good. That'll be fine. And this will be in some kind of emergency situations, like say, if I'm to my, if I'm exactly to my right, this will come in handy. But anyway, I think that's enough for now. I think I'm satisfied. Finally. I know what some of you are thinking. Yeah, some of you are thinking, yeah, it took you long enough. But anyway, thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like some kind of hot plasma in the middle of a forest. Spreading out of control. And uh, I'll see you next time. Go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out and have a good one and have a nice day. So much for watching this let's play if you really enjoyed it then check out the annotations for some more let's plays i've done in the past or if you're on a mobile platform that's what the cards are for